Let's talk high school wrestling. 21 individuals, two teams, won state championships this past weekend. Three of those 21 individuals, female wrestlers. Told you last year about this young lady at the top of the podium, Isela Gradias Flores. She and her sister Lillian have been a part of the girls wrestling program at Mountain View. Well, Isela, sitting here on the left, won the 152 pound title. It's her first state championship. Lillian on the right there took third place at 145 pounds. Make it state title number two, Sunnyside National star Audrey Jimenez. Audrey came out on top at 107 pounds. The sophomore is well on her way to being a storied four-time Blue Devil champion. All right, on the boys' side of Division Four, watch Diego Chavez in silver and red here escape this move. Diego is now a four-time champion up the I-10 in Eloy at Santa Cruz Valley. Chavez won 160 pounds as a freshman, 182 as a sophomore, 195 his junior year, and this year went back down to 175 and won again. What a tremendous prep career for that dust devil who now become a sun devil at ASU. The Sabre Mustangs won the Division Three state championship as a team. They did so with three individual titleists, two of whom were freshmen, including this young man right here, Gabriel Gallardo at 144 pounds. And of course, there are the kings of the mat, not just here in Tucson and Southern Arizona, but in the entire state of Arizona. The Sunnyside Blue Devils won their 35th state championship thanks to eight individual kings. Jaime Rivera at 150 pounds. 190 pounder Rene Fragoso among those. It's Rivera's third state championship. The two and their head coach Anthony Leone break down the legacy that is Sunnyside Blue Devil Wrestling. Being a state champion here is it's like a legacy. You build a name for yourself that will be remembered for forever and all time. This program is just all about um, coming in the room ready to scrap you categorize just the basis of what this program is all about and why you guys are consistently so able to, to turn out champions year in and year out? Yeah, I categorize it like uh, hard work works and these kids, they, they just they buy into the system and um, yeah, it means a lot to the community, it means a lot to the school and these kids, they, they grow up and they want to be Blue Devils and they wrestle hard. What do you tell a freshman when they walk into this room, when they see the history here about what it takes to be a Blue Devil wrestler. The best thing I can say is, regardless of outcomes, regardless of anything whatsoever, never stop. Always put one foot in front of the other and keep going forward.